hey guys welcome back to my channel it's Vanessa here today I want to come and share with you something that I came up with this past weekend so if you've seen my previous video where I show you my happy mail um, from Paulette I share with you that we went on a little road trip a three-hour road trip actually to meet my brother in San Antonio to exchange uh, or not exchange but to uh, you know have a spend the weekend together and then my kids were gonna take off with him back to their home um, so we met and I wanted to get some crafting done while those three hours in the car uh, so I had to come up with a really quick uh, like a really quick crafting solution so what I did is I had this Distress Crayon storage tent from my pen pal, pal um, my pen pal Mary. She gifted me with some uh, glitter, glitter glues and some red shred inside. And this is the front of it. That's how it looks. So what I was like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna use this tent and I'm gonna put whatever i can inside and get some craft done so i've been wanting to make some handmade embellishments and i was like you know what let me get my die cutting machine start die cutting some stuff that i want to paper piece and everything so that is such a great idea right uh three hours uh you know from home to san antonio and then three hours back that was six hours to total of crafting so i was like yeah so i did my die cutting my die cutting things and I die cut a couple of coffee mugs I die cut some snow cones some cupcakes pineapples rainbows and other stuff that I'm gonna share in a minute and uh, and then I so I got the tent and then I had all of these scraps from the die cutting process so I had the rainbows, the ice cream cone, and such. So I just throw them in here on the very bottom, like so. And then I start filling out my tent. So I put all of my die cuttings, die cut pieces here, along with the glue, my tweezers, a Sharpie pen, this flower punch that I got from Michaels this is by recollection and this is a tiny little flower once it's punched it looks like so and I also got some small bling by the way this was way more a longer a longer piece than now but since I used it and excuse my nails they're all dirty and I mean they're all nasty uh, I got my We Are Memory Keepers detail scissors and put them in there. And then I popped up a few of these adhesive foam dots from Studio G. And then I just throw them in the basket, in the tin. Along with that, I added this, oops, this four stickles and this Studio G glitter glue. And I just put them in here. So it was all of this plus all of the die cut pieces which were like all of these pieces right here all of this was paper based like the top and the middle all right so i put that inside and i actually once i finish i you know put them like so then i also put this coffee cups and the little whipped cream on top in there and then this other these were all like I said needed to be um, paper pissed together so I also throw those ice cream in there and I just spread everything around so I everything can fit in there so once I had that I start organizing my glitter glues you know so I know that they can fit because I did had this unicorns that I needed to paper paste as well in there and then I had also this other cupcakes that I needed 
to get done so i did that i closed it and i throw it in my book bag that i took with me because we were gonna be walking so i don't want to take my crossbody so i just took my book bag and this fit perfectly in there and that's what i took and then when i was on the car you know i just opened it and as i was working i just took away the top of my glue and as you can see it's all messy because it was kind of drying quicker than usual so i was uh, just taking out the axis and put it in there and i was working with that and i just put whatever i was working with i will put it here on my lap and that was how i was working and i thought that was such a great idea when you're on a road trip and you want to take you know die cutting paper pieces and or die die cuts that you want to paper paste that's such a great idea also a great idea is to have some tiny scissors either this ones or the other ones the other skinny ones work as good as well but since i have these little ones i decided to take this ones with me and then whatever you know embellishments that you want to put like as long as they're tiny like this stickles I end up not using I think one of the purple I think this purple I end up not using it so I would have only took this three then I did took my tweezers that I used to paper paste and then my sharpie to draw the little eye unicorn eyes like this is one and you can see all you know each of the embellishments that I create over on my on yesterday's uh, video but this is another one that I paper piece and this one's I think that were the most uh, hard to paper piece because I had to paper piece the legs the tail and then all of these pieces come apart so I had to find the right piece that go in there and then the mouth and then I did add it the flower punch and then a little bling on the top and then if you can see here on the ear i did put some stickles in there as well so i think this was the hardest one to paper piece but everything was so cute like it ended up being adorable and i love it and then on this pineapples i just uh glitter this too because i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with them just yet so i don't want to do any embellish it with those uh there's some more horsies and then this one was one of my favorites which were the coffee cups um unicorns so this is what i create and then the rainbows they were all this three paper pieces that i needed to glue and then i did some stickles on the edges i'm not too happy with how it came because we were jumping a lot the car was moving a lot so yeah but they're cute they look cute and then this one's i didn't know what to do on top i wanted to put like magical coffee or magical something so i forgot to die cut the word magical from one of my dies and then this one's these are ice creams um again i put them together but i didn't know what else to do on them so i was like okay i'm just gonna put them together and then i can figure something out at home and then here in this little plastic bag where i have the leftover flowers i just put all of the tiny little pieces from the horse from the um rainbows so i just put them in here and then once i was able to work with or i was gonna work with them i just throw them all here and start like using them and then all of this it's already trash so i just save it so because i wanted to do this video uh, i know there's still pieces that i could use but i mean i already got enough uh you know work out of them so i think i'm gonna just go ahead and throw them already because i've been saving them just to make uh you know to use as much as possible so there's that you guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you like the idea give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment like and subscribe and i will see you in my next one bye